So what's it all about this thing we call shout outs? I think overall shout outs are great. I think uh, they give exposure to people that otherwise might not have any exposure at all. I think it's a really excellent way for people to find channels that they wouldn't otherwise have found. I think there's a certain level of, um, I don't want to say responsibility, but I think there's a privilege for people who have several thousand subscribers who've been on YouTube for a while and sort of got the system working pretty well for them. They've got a little bit of notoriety to be able to, to shout out somebody or to, to point people in the direction of a new YouTuber who's got something to offer. So I think that's a great thing. I think if you take it too seriously or too much like a job or you feel that weight of responsibility too much, that might take the joy out of it for you and that could ruin it for you as the person doing the shout outs. I do find personally for myself when I'm watching a, a video and an individual is doing a shout out, I find it a little more enjoyable when, when that shout out is worked into the story of the video itself. If so and so is doing a, a video about a certain thing, they're blogging about something, um, I think that if you happen to work a shout out into that, you could say, okay, today I'd like to talk about depression. A lot of people suffer depression. Uh, what kinds of things can we do to help people who have depression? Uh, the other day I was watching a video on depression by so and so, and they had some really good things to say. Um, if you're interested in depression and you're interested in this kind of discussion, uh, you might want to check out so-and-so because he or she has done this particular kind of video. That kind of a shout-out, I think, is really, really cool. Um, because it, it, it still gives your video a topic. It still gives your vlog a topic in and of itself. And yet it gives you a chance to plug somebody else's channel or somebody else's video and it does it in a very nice way and it's not a, a, a pandering way it's not a fawning way now having said that I would like to say that what Billy does is excellent okay I think that his watch worthy youtubers is fine it's really good I don't have a problem with it now I'd like to talk about the way I watch it what I will generally do is I will watch his introduction listen to what he has to say to get get the show started then I'll go above in the bar and I'll watch the individual uh, youtubers to see what what they're like and make a mental note of whether this is someone I'm gonna want to subscribe to or not I'm gonna go out and go to their channel or not so sort of make a mental note and then what I might do is sort of just start the video over and watch it all the way through now on a rare occasion I found that the people that were featured weren't really my cup of tea and so I didn't really subscribe to those people or whatnot but a lot of times the majority of them or half of them or at least one of them is somebody that I find interesting and w willing to kind of follow up on and so I'll go to their channel and I'll watch it and I'll subscribe to their channel and I have found a lot of people that I really enjoy that way. So there's no doubt in my mind that what Billy does and others like him, Chin, Chin Wart's doing this now, and others like him, are, I think those kind of videos are helpful. Um, but I would like to see a lot more of the shout out sort of just merged and blended with regular vlogs. I like Billy's vlogs and I like when he brings up an issue and talks about a subject or tells a story or what have you and just the idea of maybe working in working in uh, a shout out that way I don't know I don't know if this is even helpful at all um, another thing I would like to, to say to the people who are, are watching the shout out videos don't feel that you need to subscribe to everyone you see. You know, don't feel like you're letting someone down if you watch the shout out video and you don't go subscribe to them. The truth of the matter is, if we're not on YouTube for fun, what are we doing here? 
if you don't want to watch a video, don't watch it. If you don't want to subscribe to someone, don't subscribe. Now, there's no excuse for rudeness. There's no excuse for being a troll. There's no excuse for causing trouble for anybody. Just simply don't go there. Simply don't watch. Find the channels you do want to watch. I think it's just a guide. It's just help. It's just another tool we have to find people so we can watch. So we can enjoy each other's company. We can enjoy a community together. Be supportive. Be encouraging. Be helpful. But don't be locked into it slavishly. Don't say, okay, Billy says we have to go watch these guys. I better subscribe to them. Because I don't subscribe to them. No one will subscribe to me. Blah, blah, blah. Then we're just playing that game. And we don't want to play that game. We want to be a community. We want to have fun. We want to enjoy each other. But we don't want to be slaves to the system, right? And as far as that, I got to get so many subs so that I can, you know, become a partner. Whatever. Was it helpful? Did I say anything useful at all? I don't know. I think what you do is fantastic. Billy, what you do is great. You're, you encourage people, you help people, you guide people to other people. You know, if you're second guessing what you do, I want you to second guess only because you think you can do something better. I don't want you to second guess because you think other people think you should be doing something better. After all, when all is said and done, this is for fun. We want to encourage, we want to help, we want to be good to each other, but it's for fun. Oh, by the way, subscribe, please, man, subscribe. i got a great channel, i got some new videos coming up. got to see it, you got to see it, you're going to love it. I shoot stuff, I go out in the woods and I point a gun and I shoot stuff. And then, then there's some more guns and some other people are shooting stuff. And I promise, I'll come up with a, I'll come up with a comedy video soon. i got to work out some... Editing is a nightmare, you know? It's a nightmare to edit this stuff. So give me some time. I, wanna, I have some more ideas, there's some more characters I haven't tried out yet. Some more plots, some more themes, some more... Don't give up on me, man! Don't give up on me. And sign up your friends. I need subscribers. I got 80! 80 in three months that's like not very many in a year i'll never make it all right